What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. Today I got a very, very special delivery from Cardigan Donuts, which is my like favorite donut shop. I'm a huge, huge fan of cake donuts and they do cake donuts particularly well. They have a lot of different kinds. They also have a special cake donut that they brought for me that they're only doing for the next week, I want to say. And it's this carrot cake donut. Looks ridiculous, right? Oh. Looks to be an old fashioned style, which are also cake donuts. They're made with sour cream typically. So I can't remember every single flavor that they have, so we'll have to just kind of taste and guess. But I do know this right now is my favorite of their donuts. It's a French cruller. So these are made with the same dough or batter that you use to make cream puffs, pate choux. So it's actually hollow on the inside. Oh my gosh, so good. It's also how they make churros. This is their churro donut. It has the exact same shape, so I'm thinking it's the exact same dough and that it's got just a cinnamon sugar situation on the outside. I also have this dipping sauce for the churros on the side. This is the shirt they gave me <laughs> that they made for National Donut Day. Obviously, I'm going to wear it. I'm going to try to taste every single one of them. Um, and then whenever I don't eat, I'm just going to have for leftovers because donuts are good for at least a few days, so. <laughs> Alright, I'm actually going to start with the back row. And they said this one was pecan pie. Mmm. So good. Mmm. It's got little bits of pecan. All inside the filling. It's a little sweet, little cinnamony. That's so good. I am gonna eat so many donuts right now. Oh my god. Okay, next. Also filled chocolate on top, and there's a looks like a candied cherry. Just cream inside, regular cream. Mm. I love maraschino cherries. I don't care if it makes me like a five year old. Okay. This one has to be Reese's, obviously. It's got Reese's pieces on top, peanut butter in the center, and what appears to be a chocolate glaze. Mm. These raised donuts, these all three of these have been raised. They're so light. And these particular donuts are not, like the donuts themselves are not that sweet. So this one looks like a fritter. 
maybe apple cinnamon. Mm hmm This one is amazing. Also a raised donut. It's got these nooks and crannies though. And so there's like these little crunchy crispy bits. And there's bits of cinnamon kind of like going throughout the dough. Oh my gosh, how am I going to get through all this donut? Pretty sure this is a jelly donut. That's what I'm hoping for. It tastes like applesauce inside, but that they spiced it with something different. Okay, I think that this is coffee cake. Wow. That tastes so much like coffee. I mean, in your face coffee. Mm. And this is a cake donut. They're just, they're not too dense. They've got a nice crisp on the outside. So good. So good. Oh my god. All on top, you see the toasted coconut. And you can tell it's fresh. Mm. 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 I love coconut. I know people are kind of on coconut. Shane doesn't like it. I do. It's not too coconutty. It's just a little bit because most of the coconut flavor is coming from the top here. Mm -hmm. They have to have toasted that themselves. It just, you know, when you toast something, um, it's fresh. It's actually crispy. I feel like if it's not fresh and stale, it gets kind of chewy and sticky. Not at all. I'm going to go with this one next. <clears throat>
The whole thing kind of tastes more like cobbler. Mm. Maybe brown butter. I think that's what it is. Brown butter. Am I right? Okay. I think I want to try the churro now. It's like hollow on the inside. Yeah. That's what I mean by the powder shoe. And you'll see the same thing in here. It's a little bit eggier. I love the little ridges along the outside because it gives like such a nice texture. All right. Ooh, this is my fave. <laughs> it's beautiful. It's so rich. The inside is so tender and soft and like custardy. These are a little bit sweeter. The donut itself is definitely sweeter than the yeast donuts, but it's still so good, so good. Let's try the carrot cake donut. That is so good. That's an old fashioned. It's so rich. Oh my gosh. Like a bite or two of one of those and I'm good. Well, maybe after all of this, these other donuts, it's good. <laughs> what haven't I tried? Ooh, I think it's blueberry. That's one of my favorite flavors, by the way. Blueberry cake donut, forget about it. Oh my gosh. I don't know if I've told you guys, but I have actually like kind of a difficult time eating like a large amount of sweets. So I definitely like Coming into this, I was like, okay, I could take one bite of everything. And of course, I start off taking three bites of the first donut. My plan went to hell immediately. Whew. These are tough for me. <laughs> 
fun, so much fun at the same time. I've never sat down and gotten to try every single donut that a donut shop offers at the same time. It's kind of amazing. Ooh. Okay. I just want a bite of the, the regular glazed. This looks like a raised donut. Oh. Why anybody that lives around here would go to Krispy Kreme when this exists? I don't know. Alright guys, actually I'm gonna call it right now because I feel like anything extra that I eat is just not gonna make me feel very well. But this was amazing. I mentioned it at the beginning of the video, but Cardigan Donuts just started offering delivery. Obviously restaurants are not able to operate like they normally do right now so they're having to get creative and offer services that they might not have been before i guess they they have been on a couple of these delivery apps but now they're putting their some of their own employees to work that can't work in the normal way they would they're hiring them as delivery drivers which is amazing so they're servicing like the entire metro area from 694 to 494 which is basically like just encompasses all of metro minneapolis to place your order you just go to cardigan donuts website i will put that right here you have to place your order the day before for delivery so the night before or you can place it up to a week in advance and they will bring you donuts the next day okay guys again i'm so full and i feel like i'm about to hit a sugar rush hard <laughs> So I'm going to go prepare for that. All right, guys, thank you so much for joining me today. I hope everybody is staying really, really safe, hopefully staying home the majority of the time unless you absolutely have to leave the house. I plan on actually starting to order in my groceries. I've been working out at home. I really haven't been going anywhere. Hope you guys are staying safe, protecting yourself. If you're showing any signs of coronavirus, you definitely need to call your doctor explain the symptoms that you're having and then they will let you know if they think it's a good idea for you to come in get checked out get tested whatnot so let's just hope that we get some sort of remedy for this whole situation sooner than later so we can all go back to our lives as usual thank you guys so much for joining me again today and i will see you guys soon Love you. <laughs> Bye.